Good morning, lovely people. It's a fantastic, gloriously sunny, clear skies morning. I've got an outfit ready and I've got myself dressed up to do the photo shoot. So I've got my makeup and I've got my big red lip. This is Fenty lipstick. I don't really like it. Um, but you know what? It matches this dress. So you're going to get an exclusive behind the scenes to see how we actually get the photo shoots done. <laughs> So we've done the pictures in front of the Christmas tree that I wanted us to get. I've grabbed one of the Christmas tree decorations. And now we're going to go outside because natural light is always best. But, love, can you open the door for me, please? <laughs> strong, man. So we have to be super quick outside because it's a glorious wintry day and there's frost on the grass and everything looks very pretty frosted over. But it means I'm going to get cold very quickly. And I'm going to have to spend the rest of the day completely wrapped up. So this is going to be super quick. Okay, so that was the uh, photo shoot done. It took us about five minutes. We have to be super quick and use a super fast process in winter because I don't want to get cold. But because it's not Christmas, hang on. Hi. Um, so I'm going to change out of it now because this is going to be some one of my outfits for Christmas Day. Um, but I'm so glad I got the opportunity to show it to you now because I don't have any plans of actually recording uh, for Vlogmas on Christmas Day. So I'm just going to change out of it and put on all of my thermal layers now and try and get really, really warm <laughs> for the rest of the day. We are currently going off into uh, Leeds Market place to go buy the vegetables that we're going to need for the big Christmas uh, day event. Um, we've got loads of baking, loads of cooking, and I've got more sewing because I have to sew the other Christmas stuff. So yeah, hang out with us. And uh, oh, that's my makeup today. My shadow today and the lipstick. Yeah, kind of. I'm feeling really good, feeling really good. But it's not all going to get ruined when I take this off. <laughs> okay, this is my outfit for today. It's my Helmi tunic. And I'm double layered up with fleece tights and leggings just to make sure that I don't get too cold. And I'm just going to set off, um, head off into town now. So I'll catch up with you guys after I come back from town. <laughs> Okay, so I got some sushi, rice, got the seaweed wraps, got some gyoza dumpling wraps, wasabi sauce, and I also got a bamboo mat to do the sushi. We also got the sausages for the mini sausage uh, rolls for Christmas Day. 
uh, got some ox tail from the butchers and Ooh. also some streaky bacon. Uh, so our cheese board is complete. We got some cheese from the markets. We've got this one, the Snowdonia Black Bomber, lovely rich flavor. We have a smoked cheddar, always a good selection. Some goat's cheese, nice and soft in flavor, some creamy. Um, and we've got a Seto Bomber. Oh, this was something unique and different that we haven't tried yet. So it's covered in black wax, should be very interesting. And we've got a Seto Blue. We couldn't quite find the Leeds Blue. But we've got the settle blue and then of course we've got the isni saint uh brie so that's our cheese board complete the clotted cream is ready now so i just have to peel off the curds on top and then what we have underneath is just delicious clotted cream mm, mm, mm. Mm. so I'm just using a teaspoon to scrape off the hardened curd at the top and then I will drain the liquid here I'll use that for making scones and then I'm gonna put the clotted cream into a storage box One of the nice things of having quite a mild winter is that we can get uh, chives and spring onions relatively early. And I have some onions over here so I can get the green bits. And I've got some chives here. Not the freshest, but still usable. So this is the clotted cream, absolutely gorgeous. We're going to keep this liquid here and we're going to use that for making scones. But mm. And there it is in its final resting place, let's tap away, mm. so good, so, so good. Talk about the cost. I've just managed to finish all of the food prep for um, the gyozas and the sushi, but I've had to take some painkillers and just have a bit of a rest because a PMS has come to visit. I am grateful that it's not on Christmas Day. I'm very grateful for that. And it tends to be the one thing that forces me to slow down each month. And it's normally just for the one day that's very full on. And I have to have a hot water bottle, as I do now, <laughs> and uh, take loads of painkillers in order to uh, barely manage so this is me right now in the lounge waiting for the painkillers to kick in but i've got my laptop so i can get some work done on my blog i've kind of neglected my blog a little bit so i'm working on some blog posts and what you know kind of coming up with an idea of things that i want to do for 2021 uh, the sort of content that i want to create and i also need to edit some pictures oh the double <laughs> Um, yeah, so then writing uh, the blog posts and processing the pictures and yeah, and I should be back on my feet in a few hours once the painkillers have have kicked in and and then I'll sleep and then overnight everything gets better because um, I don't know, there's just something about sleeping that makes things a heck of a lot better. But in the background, I'll have a movie playing. And I've got um, Roman Holiday with Audrey Hepburn and Gregory Peck. I love that movie. I just, I love that movie so much. Uh, so I ha I'll have that playing uh, in the background. So this is my version of chilling out, doing something on my laptop, working whilst watching TV, either that or knitting, but I kind of don't feel like knitting right now. 
Um, so yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back very soon. <laughs> Thank you.